Welcome everyone. In this video, we are going to perform object detection using the YOLO model. Now YOLO usually stands for you only live once, but here YOLO stands for you only look once. So YOLO is basically an, uh, an AI model which is used for object detection. So for that we are going to install some packages first which is Transformers, Ultralytics Plus and after that after that what we are doing is we are uh, importing our predefined model not predefined model pre-trained model so that we don't have to use uh, expensive GPUs to train models on our own system so we have this pre-trained model and we are setting the parameters here so changing the parameters basically affects how your model performs, how accurate it is, how fast it is, how much time does it take to train and after we have uh, configured the parameters to our liking we are uh, feeding it images so as you can see we have uh, feeded some images first is of these two people it can identify person and also a tie a tie is such a small object in this entire image it's not even the focus of this image but our AI model is still able to recognize this tie and uh, you may be wondering what these uh, numbers are it's basically 89% confidence that confident that this is a person so it's 0 0.89 it's 74% confident that uh, this highlighted object is a tie so it's basically confidence score so we are providing our model another image let's see what it can find here handbag, person, truck, traffic light, stop sign as you can see it can it uh, the model has the capability to to drill down in even the smallest of the objects let's see another example person person chair only a small portion of portion of the chair is visu visible but still our AI model is able to recognize that it's a chair same goes with this tie this girl is not even in the focus but still uh, the tie this girl is wearing was uh, detected and then look let's look at another example all of this just goes on to show how powerful the YOLO model the YOLO model is actually is without fail it uh, recognizes many of the smaller details like a mouse a bottle many of us may have also ignored the bottle or we it's it's possible that we wouldn't even notice the bottle in the first place but our model was able to detect it and that's a good thing let's look at another image here as usual it has detected a lot of images a chair, a potted plant, a person, a book, a dining table. This is not actually a dining table, but we can let this slide because it has able to detect many other objects and it's not a huge deal if it has not been able to detect this dining table properly. But if you see here, it's an actual dining table and our model has detected it properly. As you can see, in this specific scenario, our model hasn't detected a lot of things because there is there are le less of things here and more of architecture like building, swimming pool. So our model was only able to uh, discover chairs in this image. So that was it for this demonstration and thanks for watching.